Listen live online. Yo, Vito! I just got a phone call from Mars, man. It said you just went global. So without any further ado, it's the heavy hitter, Global Vito. Let's go, baby. Once again, man, it's Raps First. Your host, House Money, a.k.a. Safe House, if you can find me. You know how it's going down, man. This kind of show, we talk about music, sports, relationships. I try to get get into it all, man. You know what I'm saying? You can check us out every Wednesday, 11 o'clock, freeagentradio.com. Shout out to Big Cam in the building. I'm still waiting for you to come through, Cam. What's good? What's good, baby? Without further ado, I got some special guests in the house. I am not alone tonight. I got the heavy hitter, DJ Bet, 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 Rock. Rock. First of all, man, shout out to Global Vito, but guess what? I found out a, 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 a dirty lie about Vito. <laughs> she found out, My man. man. Mitch told me that Vito transformed one Saturday night. Well, he was doing a party for Lenny, Lenny Green. Uh oh. He was rocking on a controller. Like, uh, uh, uh. Listen, for an hour, listen, for an hour. listen. So and that's a problem. If there's any, are there any pictures? Huh? Any pictures? I'm, I'm gonna guess that's a problem. Vito, you're cut. You're wow. cut now. You're cut now. Under the, you ain't one, you under ain't the, the radar. OG, man. So, yeah, yeah. So we'll, we'll have to get a DJ Ratchet. Now you're Ratchet DJ on a controller? Mm, that's, mm, two, mm. that's two and a half strikes. Anyway. I got another special guest, man. Who you got, man? Brother Fatim. Fatim. Peace. What's team. up, a team? What's up, man? Everything's good. How you doing, my brother? I'm doing all right, man. Let everybody know exactly how you get down, man. Because these people, you know, this is freeagentradio.com. My brother for team, he's all over the place. Let them know what's tell going him, on, man. Tell them what you do, exactly. Yeah, man. Tell, tell them, 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 tell them. who you represent, brother. Guys, I'm the executive producer for Reverend Al Sharpton, two of his nationally syndicated radio broadcasts. I also uh, produce a program at uh, 107.5 WBLS in New York City called Open Line. I am also a co-host with a young lady called uh, Connie in Stir It Up program. So I'm out there trying to do my thing right now. All right, man. You get a chance to check out the Grammys, man? You guys get a chance to check it out? I didn't get that boring Grammys, man. A lot of people were nodding out on that, man. Why Why do you, why you conti- Why was it boring? Because a lot of people on Facebook were telling me it was boring. Yeah, it was why, boring. Why you was boring. I mean, it, it seems like there was a... First of all, you know, Lamar, can, he didn't get anything. Nothing. Um, again, uh, you don't see too many black artists performing. You don't see the mainstream artists out there. You only see the superstars. And at the end of the day, you don't see the new stars coming out there. And the Grammys is it's just not what it used to be. I'm going to tell you, Kendrick um, performed with uh, Imagine Dragons, uh, a rock band. You know, and, and if it wasn't for that, we probably wouldn't have seen him that night. That's the only time he got any shine. Um, Macklemore beat him out best rap song um I got video. A, yeah, I, I, you, you know what I'm saying so you know and this guy he's independent Macklemore now I, I talked about this last week this guy's from Seattle you know um white rapper you know um everybody before was hating on him but you know the locks co-signed him saying you know he's independent he's doing his thing let him rock you know, uh, Benzito also came to his uh, defense. But when Macklemore won, you know, he felt that Kendrick should have won. You know, so, but he took the award with, you know, pride and represent, you know, the whole night. But, you know, I didn't see, like you said, a lot of black performance. And, you know, it's it's ironic um, that you just said but Kendrick uh, performed with a, a rock band. Um, when I I was at the last Grammys in New York City, and when Eminem won the award um, for best uh, album or best song, uh, he came out and he thanked the rappers and the MCs that came before him. And I don't have no knock. I'm not gonna uh, knock the other brother who won. But at the end of the day, it's it seems to be a blackout. It's our music does not get the shine at the Grammys that like it should. I, you know. I'm telling you, you know, I think it was either the video or best album. I mean, I, I like his music. Don't get me wrong. I like his music. But to not, you know, Kendrick is so much uh, better lyrically. You know what I'm saying? He paints a better picture. This guy, this guy, you know, not to take talent from him. You know, he, he was doing his thing. I, I get it. He's independent. I, I get that part. But to, to shut out Kendrick... You know, I was watching it and I was like, I was like really, really shocked, man. I, 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 you know, I couldn't, I couldn't believe it. And you take a, a, a brother like Kendrick Lamar, 
here's a brother who's very creative. And if you take a look at artists, new artists that have come out before, Alicia Keys. I'm not just limited just to rap. I'm just limited to R&B and rap. If you look at some of these big artists that had those big years of selling a lot of units, at the end of the day, they get that shine. Remember, you got a lot of award shows out there. So when you go in the Grammys, the Grammys don't want you on American Music Awards and the Billboard Awards and all that, Soul Train Awards. So if you are on the Grammys, you're supposed to shine, especially if you are that artist. Even if you're up and coming, this brother knocked the home run out the park. He was on Forbes 30, 30, man. 30 and under. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, this was his year. You know, his album was good. It wasn't, uh, you know... Half, it wasn't half done. It was done well. You know, Dre, big up to him, Dr. Dre. Um, but you know, when I was watching it, I was I was kind of disappointed, man. I really was. It, it, you know, it's kind of it's almost pushing the, the the rap music to the side. I mean, you know, Jay Z and Justin Timberlake won for uh, best rap duo. You know, I'm I'm not shocked at that. That didn't surprise me. You know, but I, I was still kind of... What what changes need to be made? What do you think needs to be made? Well, you, you'd be surprised, man. Even in uh, Billboard, you know, top 10 um, songs, only one rap album is up there, and that's um, Eminem's album. You know, I, so, I, you know, I, I don't understand, especially we have a lot of black influence uh, entrepreneurs, you know, that have a big influence on our music. And, you know, Jay-Z from Diddy, you know, making all these big moves and still, I, I don't know, it, it's not lack of talent. But they're not part of these uh, companies and these organizations. i give you an instance. I'm glad you mentioned Billboard because I worked at Billboard a Magazine in the past. And I, I looked at from the chart department to the editorial department. You had people of color in there. Their input was there. If you take a look at the Grammys um, at the end of the day, let, let, let's take a look at the, the, the nominations for the Oscars. Nothing, no Oprah, no, no, the blackout of the butler. So at the end of the day, we're not there. We may be out in the forefront. We may be out there as a spokesperson, spokeswoman. But at the end of the day, when the Grammys are putting this together, I don't think we're at the table. You think this is uh, personal? I don't know. If I, I, I don't. I don't know. If, I, I don't it's know. It's not if it's by personal. accident. Is you can't, I think it could be ignorance, and ignorance okay. means lacking knowledge of. So it could be ignorance. I mean, I don't want to go that far because I don't know how it works. And then I go out there and put this out there, and then I don't know. But at the end of the day, it's something that we need to look into. Well, who, because even on Twitter, Twitter mm -hmm. was going crazy, um, saying like, you know, Kendrick should have won. You know, Macklemore saying that Kendrick should have won. So obviously. You know they got it, it wrong. You gotta be exactly. They you got gotta wrong. be wrong. But they always tend to get it wrong with our music, man. We're we're the one that's always left out. Who besides Kendrick was was not represented? Who besides him? Kanye. Yeah. Okay. You know I, 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 I was surprised at that. You know, understand he had a rough year, but that, that had nothing to do with his music. You know, he wasn't up there. You know, so I I don't I don't I don't get it, and I don't count. I don't want to say I don't count Jay Z, but. That's no surprise to me that him and Justin Timberlake won. Now, if Justin Timberlake wasn't on the cut, would Jay would have won? I don't know. You know, Justin's pretty big right now. He, he's doing it. And he got, you know, best rap duo. No surprise, like I said. But Kendrick, that really surprised me. Because if you listen to his album, his album is good, man. It's good. Something's wrong, then. Something's wrong for team. Something's wrong. Something's wrong, man. That's why I said I, you got you know, to look wrong. at it from the top. And, and it's so funny how I remember when when it first started. You know when when uh, Fresh Prince and you know boycott it. Yeah, I remember when, like you know they was getting when when they they finally put it on the bill. It wasn't on screen. All of a sudden, he got the shine. All of a sudden, it's regressed. We have to we have to ask why why has it regressed? Because but I remember when. Fresh Prince boycott it. Jay Z boycott it. Like when they when they was up for the Grammys, they didn't go. You know, like you said, it was off. Like Rock said, it was off off screen. Now it's on screen. But look, there wasn't anybody really who represent our music that hard up there. Well, you have to understand that's this is why the Soul Train Awards were created. This is the reason. You have to look at this. And then even though it's not the Grammys, the Grammys is the godfather of of the music awards. 
But at the end of the day, this is the reason why Soul Train Awards uh, was created. Billboard Awards was created because at the end of the day, the, Gra it, it, the Grammys had that final say. And if it didn't go down for you, it just didn't go down. And, and people think, felt like they was left out and they didn't have nowhere to go. But I think Soul Train also, it was also got watered down. Of course, yeah. You they know, have. And, and that was sad, man, because you know what? After a while, it was just... It's no big deal anymore to watch. I even know when it comes going on. The motions because when 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 it becomes personal, when 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 our, our late great brother Don Cornelius was out there and putting this together, you're passionate about this. This is something that you you're building, and when you build something like that, you're passionate. When that creative mind sometimes goes away, that vision goes away, and once that vision goes away, then you're left with something that other people are just putting together, and they may not be no passion. With. Same thing with the BET Awards, man. Same thing. I was going to mention them, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I don't want to mess with them. Man. I don't want to mess with them. All right, man. This rap first house money, aka safe house. If you can find me, Global Veto, the heavy hitter. Take us out, baby. This much. This much. Hair, hair body on my. This much. This this much. Hair body on my. Every fly whip, I done passed it. Who's that? Who, who's she? Red carpet and bougie. Red cup of that ooh wee. And when he passed, he like, ooh see. Ooh see, there's only one me. No duplicate, no two of me. They on my sh, cause it's fly sh, and they buy sh, it ain't free. Uh. This my sh. This my sh. This my sh. Everybody on my sh. This my sh. This my sh. This my sh. Everybody on my sh. This my sh. This my shit, everybody on my shit. This my shit, this this my shit. Everybody on my shit. This my shit, this this my shit. Everybody on my shit. This my shit, this this my shit. Everybody on my shit. I'm riding rap, I'm getting it. Look, look clean. Me, trail life, that's all me. They say play safe, I was born free. Not now, but right now we gon' turn up, we gon' make it loud.